Good evening, everyone, and thank you for joining us. I'm Carol and Murray. New tonight, the search has been suspended for a nine month old boy swept away during a flash flood in southeastern Pennsylvania earlier this month. It killed his two year old sister and mother, who are all from Charleston. News 2's Kevon Dupree joins us in the studio and has more details. Kevon, they stopped the search. Carolyn, nine month old Conrad Shields has been missing since that flash flood happened on July 15th. And earlier today, officials with the Upper Makefield Township Police posted on Facebook saying in part, quote, we have exhausted all means of attempting to locate Conrad. With broken hearts, we regretfully announced that the active search for Conrad has concluded. Authorities say they found no sign of Conrad Shields body when they searched the area where the flooded creek enters the Delaware River. Upper Makefield Township police say they utilize search dogs to scour islands in the river as well as its banks, while marine units scan the river in both the Pennsylvania and New Jersey banks. They also report using divers, sonar, air units and drones during the search. Last weekend, the body of Conrad's sister, Matilda Shields, was found in the Delaware River near a Philadelphia wastewater treatment plant about 30 miles from where the flash flood occurred. The children's mother, Katie Selly, was also swept away by the floodwaters along with the children's grandmother. The grandmother survived, but Selly did not. The children's father, Jim Shields, and their four-year-old son were able to make it to safety shortly after the flash flood occurred. Now this evening, Upper Makefield Township Police said, quote, Although at this time we were unable to reunite Conrad with his loving family, he will forever live in our hearts and he will never be forgotten. The Bucks County Coroner's Office reports that four other people drowned in that flash flood as well. Reporting in studio, I'm Kevon Dupree, Count on Two.